Hello once again audience and welcome back to Dominations with Christopher. I left number one for now because I was a little bit concerned about it. Mac looked at me and teased me and made fun of me and then she went and attacked it and she actually managed to get two stars and she did quite well. Yeah. So now I'm... Well, I mean, I'm, two stars isn't like, woohoo, but it's still like, yeah, okay. that's not it's, That's not garbage though. I mean, that's good. Right? I think that's good anyways. Two stars is, is solid. And the guy says that he's industrial, but after, you know, after looking with Mac, I agree. He's not so industrial. I don't... Oh, there we go. Um, I find that when I don't have troops, like you guys saw, I, I looked at the town center, touched the info, it showed no troops, went to the chat, I said, you received blah, blah, blah. Now I go, and sure enough, I've received three troops. Or three heavies, right? Yeah. That's, I don't know. And sometimes they just don't show up at all. <laughs> yeah, if you're like Marla, they just don't show up at all. Oh, hey, I spent $3 million on a wall. I was hoping it would be pretty, but I... Uh, yeah, I thought it would be like, yeah. Well, I was all excited. I'm like, I got $3 million. I'm going to spend it on this one wall. And I did so, and it's like, here's a bar across the top. And I'm like, what? Seriously? So, I don't know. Maybe we'll... Maybe I'll try and get one more. Maybe it's like razor bar. <laughs> it's razor bar. <laughs> <laughs> no. um, oh. I have finished the big loot campaign. I got my 1.3 million a little bit earlier on. Um, we were running the stats on the actual elephant stable because somebody was complaining that they don't have as many hit points as Mahout. Uh, but the fallacy is that they do way more damage. Well, not way more. They do like 80 more damage than Mahout, but they don't have as many hit points as Mahout. But it's a different... Yeah. The way that that works is that it actually just adds one to your mercenary camp capacity and you have the ability to hire an elephant siege army. Oh, okay. So, theoretically, you could fill up your entire mercenary camp with nothing but elephant siege okay. armies. But I've And I've got one in there, plus I've got the two from the actual campaign, so we're going to drop them all on this guy. I don't nice. think he's going to be very happy about that, but... Um, let's see. We want to go with Joan and Napoleon... And now that I've got... Sure, Chris, good luck. Thanks, LB. Where are we at? Uh, 60 stars. We have 22 out of 30 attacks. They have 46 stars. 20 out of 30 attacks. They're a very active clan. Uh, or alliance. Unfortunately, they haven't been able to do much with our top three. Uh, their one came across and got 29%. Their two came across and got 12%. And their three came across and got 6% on Mac. And it looks like I would say that's a female's name, Queen Crystal. So, you know, whoop, whoop. Um, I watched Mac's Mac attack on this, but we're going to scout it. I think I'm actually going to follow your entrance point, to be it, honest. Well, it, it's a solid entrance point. I thought so. So Mac came in here, and one of the things that we noted is that there's no gate there. Uh, he does have two generals, but they're both stuck in this little, the confines of this wall. Uh, I don't have the heavy Gatling gunners that have the ability to teleport from one side of the wall to the other and then attack generals, um, as Mac does, but... Uh, we're still going to see what we can do. Um, but you came in a little bit further down here, didn't you? Yeah. So I'm thinking I might come in here. Uh, and then hopefully, yeah, because maybe... I want to come in here, I think, here. And the, the reason I say that is I want to disable, I think, even this one and this one. Uh, and then once I get through there, I'm hoping that I can, you know, get them here. I might even just dis disable the one, just like this one. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think so. Just this one and then possibly this one, because I want to bring them over here in order to run the protect on them. 
Yeah. And I've gone Canon heavy. I've actually I ditched a couple of my heavies uh, for other people's Canons or for other people's heavies. So my Alliance, I've got three heavies. Uh, in my Mercenary camp, I've got Mahout, Mahout's wife, and Mahout's best friend Bob. Um, we've got some Hessian cavalry, and I've got my elephant army that I hired. Plus, I've got two elephant armies, so you can see why I was like, yeah, I don't need as many heavies. So I stuck an extra cannon in. Yeah. That makes sense, right? Yeah. Uh, I got my two generals. So we've got eight fusiliers, 26 musketeers, uh, two supply carts, and six uh, cannons. We are on one. Let's, I'm excited. Uh, I want to see this, how this goes. Yeah. The cannon heavies. You've always been more heavy on the cannons than me. Uh, always? Well, yeah. Well, recently. Let's, uh, we're going to start out with the disposables. Since the Enlightenment age. Since the Enlightenment age? Yes. I can't say always. Because I can't remember that part back. Okay. That's all I really cared about right there. Mm -hmm. That's look at all of his troops that are stuck there, eh? Yeah. Oh, come on. Should I just leave them? Yeah, I think I should leave them. And so yeah, they seem to be doing what they're supposed to. There's the quick victory. So we're going to get them to all come back here. But you had like one little musketeer pecking off <laughs> that level 7. Oh, was yeah. there? Yeah. Oh, I think he'll do fine. Yeah, see, that they seem to be going through that kind of like waterish. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I think uh, I think we're gonna be all right. Yeah. Look at all those heavies going to town, eh? Like, look at all like those are all heavies. Yeah. Those that's... are all generals and heavies and my. Yeah. Your troops stay together very very well. Um. Yeah. See, in the back there, I've e I've even got my all my gunners are in the back there. Yeah. We got a minute thirty-seven left there. We've got a betrayal. Oh, see, I like it when they start doing that. That makes me happy. Keep doing that. Keep doing that because we're gonna need that. Okay, so that might be problematic, right? Trying to get through that area there. And I'm hoping. We don't care about no ambush trap. Mm, I would. Do something like that. Yeah, you got some fusilier still there. That needs some exercise. They haven't done anything. Yeah. Look at this general stuck in the wall. I know. Hey there, derp. What's going on, bud? How's that wall taste? Oh, see, don't, don't. Don't do that, guys. They're going to let him out. They should free him. I feel bad for him. Well, I suppose now that you're all the way through. Ah. <laughs> uh. <laughs> uh, they can free him now. <laughs> Notification. And that's so sad because, like, if you can't watch your own war replays and, like, perhaps they don't understand that their generals can't get out, like, how are you ever going to know? Well, short of somebody else, like one of your alliance members, and you know, you and I talked about earlier about even possibly just leaving and joining the other other side and saying, "Hey, guys, you know, a few things you could possibly change." I mean, not to be facetious or rude. Yeah, I appreciate it. Like these guys are extremely active. Yeah, but I mean, like, um, and I think this is the second base where the general was stuck. Yeah, yeah, it is. So. It is. That's the who else said they had a stuck general? We'll take a look. 
I'm, I'm seriously considering just popping over there real quick. Yeah, well, but who knows if they'd even let you in. I don't know. No stars on one Mac. Yeah, I think they're done. Um, I don't know if they would let me in, but I mean, should we try it? I don't know. You don't know? What's the name? No Big Deal? Because I, if I remember, in, how functional is it that? Let's just go. No Big Deal. Oh, you can't find any information but on them. You can, you can search. You can search for them and look for No Big Deal, and their number one would be Leader, or they would have a member by the name of Leader. Yeah, sure. So let's... uh. Let's just see. Yeah, so there's... It's open. They've got 22 out of 50. Yeah. Okay. Should I pop over and we'll find out? Uh, okay. Um, BRP gents. I'd say ladies and gents. But you're right here. There could be other ladies. Oh. So we're going to leave, and then we're going to go search. Uh, and then we're going to, we're going to join these guys. Oh. <laughs> This video might be a little bit longer on the basis that, uh... I wonder if they'll know it's you and kick you out right away. And then it would be so sad. Uh... Because <laughs> we don't know what his regular base looks like. I suppose. Um, three, two, watch. The replays. Maybe we should do this every time. I think we should, you know, you and I talked about it. No, you know what? Uh, I think it's I think it's it's all in good fun and it is just a game and I hope they understand that, right? Yeah. Uh, no, does I'm that sorry if I've hurt your ego. Uh, Mine gets hurt all the time. They should feel better about that. <laughs> <laughs> Who is that? That was the guy from the other side. What's the name of our alliance now? <laughs> Outlaws? Outlaws? Outlaws. Exclamation, exclamation. Outlaws. Where are we? There we are. Join. You must wait before you can make another request. What?
I didn't make a request. Am I locked out now? <laughs> Maybe. Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> Alright guys, hopefully I'll get back in. I am going to leave that there. If you, Thank you very much for watching this video. Uh, if you enjoyed it, feel free to like and subscribe down below. Um, yeah, keep your sticks on the ice. <laughs> That's a non-alliance button. Oh, okay. Sorry. No, it's alright. Anything to help? Let's try it one more time before we end the video. My Alliance. Search. Outlaws. Join. <laughs> uh, all right. Um, yeah. Keep your sticks on the ice. Have a good time. <laughs> <laughs>